Hi, Guy and Roseanne here, and welcome back to Amore Van. We're at a Corps of Engineers campground in St. Lucie, and we're right on the dam at the on the St. Lucie Canal. It's a very active waterway, uh, popular with boaters, but the water on one side of the dam is about 14 feet higher than the water on the other side of the dam. So how does that work? How do boats get from the high side or the low side, or from the low side to the high side? Well, if you're not familiar with that process, let us show you. <laughs> So the dam has a lock, and at this point in time, the water level in the lock was the same as the water level on the low side of the dam. And here you see the gates on the low side of the dam opening to allow in a boat that wants to go to the high side. Once the boat is entirely within the lock, it secures itself to lines on the side of the lock in order to be stable when the water level is increased. Once the boat or boats are secured, the gates at the low side of the lock are closed. Once the low side is fully secured, the high side is slightly opened in order to flood the lock and raise the water level. Once the water level inside the lock has been raised to match the water level on the high side of the dam, the gates on the high side open and the boats are allowed to pass merrily on their way. Well, there you have it. If you've never seen it before, that's how boats are able to pass from one side of a dam to the other. We'll see you next time here on Amore Van.